The Ingersoll Lectures is a series of lectures presented annually at Harvard University on the subject of immortality. Endowment The Ingersoll Lectureship was established by a bequest by Caroline Haskell Ingersoll, who died in 1893, leaving $5,000 for the institution of a series of lectures to be read annually in memory of her father, George Goldthwaite Ingersoll. The lectures were to take place at Harvard University on the subject of the immortality of man. The lectures were initiated by Harvard President Charles W. Eliot in 1896. They are now generally known as the Ingersoll Lectures on Human Immortality. The lectures were to be published. From 1896 to 1912 they were issued by the Horton Mifflin Company of Boston and New York. From 1914 to 1935 Harvard University Press published them. Since then, the lectures have been published in the Harvard Divinity Bulletin. Lecturers and subjects, the chosen lecturers were as follows, 1896, George A. Gordon A Euro Immortality in the New Theodicy, 1897, William James A Euro Human Immortality, Two Supposed Objections to the Doctrine, 1898, Benjamin Ide Wheeler A Euro Dionysos and Immortality, 1899, Josiah Royce A Euro The Conception of Immortality, 1900, John Fisk A Euro Life Everlasting, 1904, William Osler A Euro Science and Immortality, 1905, Samuel Maxwell Crothers A Euro The Endless Life, 1906, Charles Fletcher Dole A Euro The Hope of Immortality. Our Reasons for It, 1906 B, Wilhelm Ostwald A Euro Individuality and Immortality, 1908, William Sturgis Bigelow A Euro Buddhism and Immortality, 1909, G. Lowe's Dickinson A Euro Is Immortality Desirable? 1911, George Andrew Riesner A Euro The Egyptian Conception of Immortality, 1914, George Foot Moore A Euro Metempsychosis, 1918, Clifford Herschel Moore A Euro Pagan Ideas of Immortality During the Early Roman Empire, 1920, Charles Reynolds Brown A Euro Living Again, 1921, William Wallace Fien A Euro Immortality and Theism, 1922, Kearsa Blake A Euro Immortality in the Modern Mind, 1923, George Edwin Hoare A Euro The Christian Faith and Eternal Life, 1924, Philip Cabot A Euro The Sense of Immortality, 1925, Edgar S. Brightman A. Euro Immortality in Post-Kantian Idealism, 1926, Gustav Kruger A Euro The Immortality of Man According to the Views of the Men of the Enlightenment, 1927, Harry Emerson Fosdick A Euro Spiritual Values and Eternal Life, 1928, Eugene William Lyman A Euro The Meaning of Selfhood and Faith in Immortality, 1929, W. Douglas Mackenzie A Euro Man's Consciousness of Immortality, 1930, Robert A. Faulkner A Euro The Idea of Immortality and Western Civilization, 1931, Julius Serial Bixler A Euro Immortality in the Present Mood, 1932, William Pepperell. Montague A Euro The Chances of Surviving Death, 1933. Shayla Matthews A Euro Immortality in the Cosmic Process, 1934, Walter Eugene Clark A Euro Indian Conceptions of Immortality, 1935, C. H. Dodd A Euro The Communion of Saints, 1936, William Ernest Hocking A Euro Meanings of Death, 1937, George Lyman Kittredge A Euro The Old Teutonic Idea of the Future Life, 1938, Michael Ivanovich Rostov's If A Euro The Mentality of the Hellenistic World and the Afterlife, 1940, James Bissett Pratt A Euro The Implications of Selfhood, 1941, Alfred North Whitehead A Euro Immortality, 1942, Douglas V. Steer A Euro Death's Illumination of Life, 1943, Rufus M. Jones A Euro The Spell of Immortality, 1944, Louis Finkelstein A Euro The Jewish Doctrine of Human Immortality, 1945, Hu Euro The Concept of Immortality in Chinese Thought, 1946, John Haynes Holmes A Euro The Affirmation of Immortality, 1947, Howard Thurman A Euro The Negro Spiritual Speaks of Life and Death, 1948, Clyde K. M. Kukhan A Euro Conceptions of Death Among Southwestern Indians, 1949, Edwin Ward Aubrey A Euro Immortality and Purpose, 1950, Charles Harold Dodd A Euro Eternal Life, 1951, Georges Florovsky A Euro The Resurrection of Life, 
1952, Bill Jarmer Stephens in a Euro the Mackenzie River Coronation Gulf Eskimos, Their Concept of the Spirit World and of Immortality, 1953, Willard L. Sperry a Euro Approaches to the Idea of Immortality, 1954. Theodore Otto Weddell A Euro The Community of Faith as the Agent of Salvation, 1955, Oscar Kullman A Euro Immortality of the Soul and Resurrection of the Dead, The Witness of the New Testament, 1956, Harry A. Wolfson A Euro Immortality and Resurrection in the Philosophy of the Church Fathers, 1957, Hans Hoffmann A Euro Immortality of Life, 1958, Werner Jaeger A Euro The Greek Ideas of Immortality, 1959, Henry J. Cadbury A Euro Intimations of Immortality in the Thought of Jesus, 1960, John Knox A Euro The Hope of Glory, 1961, Hans Jonas A Euro Immortality in the Modern Temper, 1962, Paul Tillich A Euro Symbols of Eternal Life, 1963, Treslav Pelican A Euro Immortal Man and Mortal God, 1964, Amos Niven Wilder A Euro Mortality and Contemporary Literature, 1965, Eric Voegelin A Euro Immortality, Experience and Symbol, 1966, Wilfred Cantwell Smith A Euro Eternal Life, 1967, Jarwan Quarter A G. N. Moltman A Euro Resurrection as Hope, 1968, Walter N. Penck A Euro The Psychedelic Mystical Experience and the Human Encounter with Death, 1970, Elizabeth Carr One Quarter Blair Ross A Euro on Death and Dying, 1971, Liston O. Mills A Euro, 1977, Jane I. Smith A Euro Reflections on Aspects of Immortality in Islam, 1981, Victor Turner A Euro Images of Anti-Temporality, An Essay in the Anthropology of Experience, 1983, Wolfhart Pannenberg A Euro Constructive and Critical Functions of Christian Eschatology, 1984, Martin E. Marty a Euro Hell Disappeared. No One Noticed. A Civic Argument, 1985, Robert J. Lifton a Euro The Future of Immortality, 1987, John B. Cobb Jr. a Euro The Resurrection of the Soul, 1988, Wilfred Cantwell Smith a Euro Transcendence, 1989, Caroline Walker Bynum a Euro Bodily Miracles and the Resurrection of the Body in the High Middle Ages, 1990, Stephen J. Gould a Euro, 1991, Lawrence Sullivan a Euro Death at Harvard and Death in America, 1993, Marion Wright Edelman a Euro Leave No Child Behind, 1994, Jonathan Mann a Euro Health, Society and Human Rights, 1995, Stephen Katz a Euro The Shoe and Historical Memory, 2002, Daniel Cullohan a Euro The Desire for Eternal Life, Scientific vs. Religious Visions, 2005, Karen Armstrong A Euro Is Immortality Important? Religion is about inhabiting the eternal here and now. 2006, James Hal Quon A Euro Strange Fruit, The Cross and the Lynching Tree. 2008, Leo Rabatinsky A Euro From Resurrection to Immortality, Theological and Political Implications in Modern Jewish Thought. 2009, Frenna Section Wabavon A Euro The Saul A Euro Unregistered Trademark S Comeback. Immortality and Resurrection in Early Christianity, 2010, Albert Raboteau A Euro Memory Eternal, The Presence of the Dead in Orthodox Christian Piety, 2011, Robert Isdelay A Euro Cessation and Continuity, Poises in Life and Death Among Nepal's Yolmo Buddhists, 2012, Tony Morrison A Euro Goodness, Altruism and the Literary Imagination. References